The city of Albuquerque wants to put a few new road projects on a priority list for federal money. News 13's George Gonzalez is live at Rio Grande near I-40 where the city would like to see a new interchange. George. Yeah, Dean, if you've driven down here during rush hour, you know it's an area that can go, become pretty congested. And by the looks of it right now, traffic is a little bit backed up from the highway all the way down to Bellama. And the city's hope is to alleviate some of this traffic. I mean, these are the projects that we think need the, the next round of federal uh, fast act dollars. Tom Minacucci, a project analyst with the city of Albuquerque, says this is just one of six projects that has been placed high on their priority list as the state's DOT asks for money, for federal money. Now, a new interchange at I-40 and Rio Grande has been talked about for years. Now, they want a revamp that also serves pedestrians and bicyclists around the interchange. The city also wants some new features along I-25 between the lead and coal exits and Gibson. Now, the city's hope as the DOT grants gradually fixes up that stretch that there will be money for sound walls similar to what you see along I-40 near Unser to keep the noise out of the neighborhoods along that freeway. Sometimes it looks like you get used to it, <laughs> but most of the time, especially if you want to sleep during the day. Over the years, the neighborhoods have said, hey, look, that highway is kind of noisy. We'd really like to have you put in sound walls for that neighborhood because just to kind of, kind of improves our quality of life. Now, there's no estimate yet on how much a new interchange could cost or how much it could take to gather all that money. Back to you. All right, George, thank you. Now, if these projects end up making it onto the state's list for federal funding, they would not replace other priorities on the list, such as new interchanges on I-25 for Montgomery and Gibson.